Checkmates! Are you ready for a science experiment? Here are the materials we'll be needing. We need 1 cup of water on each clear container labeled cup A and cup B. Put 1 teaspoon of sugar on each cup of water and mix thoroughly until sugar dissolves. It's fine to use either white or washed sugar. I'm using washed sugar. We now have sugar water solution. The sugar is completely dissolved in the water. With only one face visible, it is a homogeneous mixture. Now let's add 1 teaspoon of sugar to the cup B. What do you think will happen? Will there be any changes? Hmm, let's see. We can now see slight color difference with the solutions. But we are aiming to see more saturated effect on the cup B. So, let's add another 1 teaspoon of sugar to the cup B. Mix mix mix! Parang sarap na ino man ito ah! Some sugar were not dissolved. These are now the unsaturated and saturated solutions. Unsaturated ang cup A dahil mas marami ang water at kaya niya tunawin ang sugar. Saturated naman ang cup B dahil mas marami na ang sugar sa kaya ang tunawin ang water. Parang kapag usog ka na, hindi na kaya ng dami tunawin. The more sugar we put, it will become super saturated. Hindi na kaya ng water to nawin ang excess sugar. It have reached its limit or the saturation point. But it can still be dissolved given the right temperature. Just like your sugar syrup sa natriflan. Pero eto, I'll use this for my calamansi juice later. Thank you, Agnes, for watching!